Hello and welcome to Sulze Moors. This is a used van from Carmen Mobiles, Ontario T1. This thing here will cost 42,000 uh, euros. It dates to April 2012. It's got 61,100 on the clock. Incidentally, if you're interested, you're going to have to freeze the uh, thing and get the address there from uh, uh, the screen. Now, um, contact the seller directly. Uh, curiously enough, today um, somebody parked next to me and uh, they had one of these vans. I thought, oh, yeah, I'll go and see them. I've never been in that van before. And it looked really interesting. Carmen Mobile no longer does this type of thing. And first thing we we'll have to say here this here, this is a real innovation for the time. This large uh, window up here. Now, I know there were large windows. Uh, in uh, but not so much in a van of this nature it seems to me it seems to me well it's got a very large lounge down here we'll have the the water I think there you go showing it's in a double floor and we've got down here I wonder what this could be storage in the double floor well you can see it's been used somebody's uh, left uh, the uh, the thing open so I've got bits of uh, well either that or it's it's not um, it's not properly sealed so I've got bits of leaves and things in here Nice big uh, wardrobe here. All right, due to danger of falling, not for small children under three years of age. Yeah, I don't know why they stopped making these things. I know the I know the boss for Germany of the company. I'll ask him next time I see him. Saw him last week by uh, total coincidence. I saw him in Munich. Well, I think this has got quite a lot going for it. I'm sorry, wrong one. Yeah, I, I had one of these in my van and I had to replace them. I think this is, it's definitely got something about it, this van here. Bit of charm. Right, um, so there you have it, Fiat Ducato. It's got a two year guarantee, they give two year guarantees and everything here. Um, you can see it has been used a bit though, it's not, uh, some of the vans I've got here are absolutely immaculate, Well, it, but this isn't one of them. So, uh, I don't think I'd give this details. If I did, I, I'll give them again. 657 centimetres long, 285 wide, uh, width 230, uh, 158 horsepower. Next test is due April 2021, and they got April 2012. Uh, so, it's got a rear camera. It's got the, the uh, place for your bike. So I can show you one or two other vans which uh, I could sort of, in the same sort of price bracket. Now they've got this thing here, for example, which is from Knaus, which is a uh, the Knaus Sport, very unusual looking van. This thing is 45,000 and it's April 2012. And it's also been used. Unusual look to it. 
bed at the back. And there's a bed up here. Looks a bit like a spaceship. Probably drives like one as well. Sport liner 600 mg, 80,500 on the clock. Uh, there's another Canals model here. Uh, it's over 52,000, so I'm coming off the price range a little bit uh, there. I like to, when I compare things, I like to do things in a favor and I'll make it realistic. integrated van so there's the extra money 10,000 more for an integrated sounds about right to me this thing here is from it's 40,000 on the clock and it is from August 2014 so it's 48,000 I put the price down so that shows you that the Carmen Mobile actually maintains its price a bit better I've got a Heimer here and uh, this is the Heimer Tramp, 50,000 euros, uh, April 2013. I think this is perhaps uh, of the van. So I don't know, I'd probably go for this one, to be quite honest, if it were, if it were mine, I had the money. And bed over the top there, and at the back as well, with some steps up to the bed. That gives you a rough idea. Remember, if you want to see anything in more detail, yeah, just write down in comments below, and I'll try and do it. Any comment uh, about the van? I mean, I'm not selling the thing, so bear that in mind. But um, if you do, you just need to contact the seller. And if you can't, if I would, exp quite honest, if I was selling the things, I would actually be checking the comments to see what people were writing. Um, now, if you want something a bit newer, actually, this is uh, it's locked, so I can't get in. But, uh, this this thing here I find particularly interesting. This is an Eastman Bischoff, and uh, let's see how old it is. And it is from uh, 2013. Oh yeah, mind you, 80,000 is not fair. Not a fair comparison. This Optima Deluxe as well is probably going to be a lot more money. Uh, so that's nothing. Oh, 50,000. Yeah, that's a fair comparison if it's open. Let's see. Now, for hobby, hobby's got a very distinctive style, and I think that I recognise this as being a hobby van, but this doesn't quite follow its usual distinctive look. Oh, it's quite nice. This a uh, little detail like that. Something to hold on as you're coming up the bed. Okay, it does look slightly used, but not very used. However, kept this in, did so and kept it in excellent condition. Well, I'll get these things as well. Excellent. Get uh, you know twelve volt plugs, but you need the the ones like this. They don't they cost next to nothing. I think I paid some like a euro each, or maybe even no, it was about a euro twenty, but it wasn't it wasn't a lot. quite like that one. Um, this thing here is six meters in length if I remember rightly and we'll just get the details of that now. So this thing here 50,000 euros it is six meters as I said just 10,000 kilometers on the clock and uh, it is from March 2019. Okay right so oh like a 42,980 I think we'll have to finish it off here because I'm thinking I'm just doing too much Oh, and that one's locked, so we're not getting in it anyway. So, uh, there's, a, there's a hybrid Purcell, which you can see in a 
different film and a low roof personal. The high roof one, I sort of thing, I, I think uh, I'd like to go for. But anyway, let's go back now to this Carmen Mobile Ontario. Uh, very unusual van, I think. And uh, anyway, so if you found that of interest, uh, do please uh, subscribe. And every subscription does actually help me, I think, because it puts, puts me up further on the um, when the on on the ratings and the uh the more views i get the more films i can actually do thanks very much for watching and uh you'll see me in the next video if i stand in front of a mirror <laughs>